1957 Chevy Bel Air two door 454 big block uh, pushing about 800 horse um, 36 color paint yes. that's considered Amazing. apricot I don't know if you guys could pick that up but it's like a real pearly color I've never even seen anything like that before and integrated into the paint is skulls. How many skulls are on here about? Might be over a thousand. Wow, really cool. This is definitely one of the most unique cars I've ever seen. Yeah, father and son's team put that together. Mm -hmm. Basically, uh, 36 different colors in it. Father was uh, colorblind, believe it or not. Really? <laughs> uh, all the uh, emblems, as you see, like the Bel Air and the Chevy, that's yeah. all airbrushed. Yeah, that looks crazy. It looks real. The, uh, the bumpers come off, they held with, uh, they have pins, cotter pins that hold them in place. Mm -hmm. As you see, they have a historical uh, yeah, I see that. Uh, reflection from the uh, license plate, as well as the lights themselves, and reflection on the bumper. Uh, yeah. And the, uh, the kid's high school car. invested in the car uh, plus about uh, 80 to, to uh, 300 hours in airbrush time fire it up sure let's check out the interior first I noticed that the doors they open up uh, like a suicide style yeah, the cool. suicide doors and the uh, the windows actually go down and up. Uh, believe it or not, it's a pro stock automatic uh, street car. Everything, a lot of billet accessories. Now, once you close the windows, you can uh, once you close the door, you can actually open up the windows once the car is started. Otherwise, the windows will not open. Um, the suicide latches are on the inside of the car and underneath the fenders to get mm -hmm. the doors open. Okay. And. Uh, Fire it up. Fire it up. Let me just put a Chevy. Uh... Yeah, Pretty loud. <laughs> I think I failed to mention open headers. And open headers. <laughs> the uh, mural work is amazing. I keep catching like some hints and, and different things, uh, murals all over the place. Yeah, and underneath the car, or if you flip the car over, it's just as nice. There's just as much detail underneath the fenders. If I was to pull the seats apart, the whole car is even painted underneath the seats. Wow. So the, the detail that went in is just. Yeah, it's sick. Amazing. It's got the 90s on the front and the uh, 50s on the back. Wow. From the inside of all the fenders, too. Yeah, the, the airbrush was done by uh, a fellow by the name of Joe Salpy. And they uh, they have a place out in Oh, Ledgewood. here he is right here, yeah. They have a place out in Ledgewood, New Jersey. Wow, he does amazing work. And if you look at the trunk, the show you the trunk. gas tank is there. You can see behind the wheels he's got a uh, almost like a wood grained yeah, airbrush really cool. in there. You know and the battery's hidden under here and it's got an on off switch so if you want to shut the battery off. Yeah so, nice and clean. You know. So thank you. Awesome. Yeah it's a real real nice car. Had it for a few years now. Really cool. I'll show you how you open up the car. Coming through here and 
basically the door just slides open like that. Well, thanks for showing us your car today. It's definitely uh, a You're one of a welcome. kind showpiece. Thank you. Really appreciate it. Yeah, it's one best in show in several several events. It's just awesome. Yeah, I'll be honest with you. I just came back from a car show and there's no paint jobs out there like this. No. Nothing. Well, thanks for checking us out today. My name is Michael from Weeby Autos. Our number is 516-729-2003. Check out more details and pictures on our website at WeebyAutos.com. Thanks a lot.